Hi, welcome to SolidWorks 2017 video tutorial. Again, it's all about copying sketches and putting them onto non-parallel planes. So, let's have fun with SolidWorks. So, to do this exercise, I need an axis. So, first I want to create an axis, and that would be an intersection of the front plane with the right plane. And confirm. Now, with that axis, I can create some angled planes, and the reference would be the front plane, and the first one should be at 30 degrees. Confirm. Next one. Should be to the front plane with 90 degrees. Confirm. Next one. should be at 150 degrees. One five zero. And the last one I don't really need. Okay. Okay, let's copy that sketch. That's possible by Ctrl C and Ctrl V, or select it and go to Edit, Copy, select the plane, Edit, Paste. So it's copied, but it doesn't look in the right direction. But I will care for this later on. Now. Control V for the next one. Control V for the one, and you could put one on the same plane, on the front plane. Control V. So I got four sketches, which are not fully defined, and I need a point as reference. So I will go back in time here and we'll create a point a reference point so go for features go for a point and that would be the axis intersected with the front plane top plane with the top plane and confirm now I could use that point as reference move back Go to sketch 4, tools, sketch tools, modify. Let's, let's take a closer look. You can move those three points. And there should be somewhere my reference point. It's up here, point 1, yes. So just drag this up to that reference point and you can snap on it. And then you can rotate it by 90 degrees. Close that one. Select the next one. Again. Tools. Sketch tools. Modify. Now grab that point, move it up to that point and snap on it. Okay. Again rotate by 90 degrees. Close. The next one, sketch six. Tools. Sketch tools. Modify. Grab that one. 
move it up to that point here again 90 degrees close and the last sketch is in the same place as the first one so go to tools sketch tools modify and drag that point to that point up here yes snap on it and now click on that point you can mirror I thought that's the mirror Did I get it wrong right click on it and then it will be mirrored nice I have only two if you want to get those sketches fully defined you have to go into inside the sketch and make a coincident relation but in this case I will leave it like this and will go for my sketch five and edit those dimensions this one should be 10 and the diameter should be 240 did I get the right one? maybe I have to yes we can update okay fine let's hide those planes and make a loft so I select it right here right there here there and here it looks pretty good yes and now for the last and first section I want to have it normal to profile normal to profile confirm and I'm done so it seems I went for a sheet because I went for a surface loft but for the normal loft it's the same procedure that's the lofted for space it works in the same way and again for first and last normal to profile normal to profile and now I'm really done so I hope you enjoyed this one if you liked it please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my facebook cat fan page would be very nice of you I want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well thanks for watching see you to the next one bye bye